usually try to make my own um, this here using glycerin and water combination of glycerin and water because we, we do not take alcohol based tinctures uh, here so it worked really well I do need to adjust a sp the specific recipe before I show it on the channel to make sure that I've got it all correct and um, uh, preserve it much more better than I did this time so the tincture is very strong than the infusion of course because it's concentrated and it's usually used to help with the problems with relating to excess acidity it can be combined with um liquish root it can be combined with angelica and really good to take if you are suffering from joint pain as well and from arthritis the tincture of meadow sweet is very great for arthritic pains so you can also use the uh, meadow sweet herb as a compress meadow sweet herb was growing all around the forest in Finland uh, last year and I was just so excited to find it and I harvested and it was just amazing I used the flowers to make different things from an oil infused oil to using it in baking as well but it's actually one of the most popular uh, herbs that is known as an anti-inflammatory because it contains chemicals that are considered anti-inflammatory and these chemicals are called salicylic uh, and they were first extracted in the 1830s so uh, after that uh, the herb was used for all sorts of things from it being an anti-inflammatory to an anti-rheumatoidic it helps with arthritis pain as well and it's really great for the digestive system it's actually used for digestive problems so anything to do with bloating with excess gas with um, digestive issues as well meadowsweet is a gentle herb that actually serves as a diuretic but it's actually one of the most popular uh, herbs that is known as an anti-inflammatory because it contains chemicals that are considered anti-inflammatory and these chemicals are called salicylic uh, and they were first extracted in the 1830s so uh, after that uh, the herb was used for all sorts of things from it being an anti-inflammatory to an anti-rheumatoidic it helps with arthritis pain as well and it's really great for the digestive system it's actually used for digestive problems so anything to do with bloating with excess gas with um, digestive issues as well meadowsweet is a gentle herb that actually serves as a diuretic so it's gently it uh, cleanses the body from the toxins and it actually promotes sweating as well so a great herb to incorporate into your uh, healing routine as well so there are a couple of warning signs and a couple of side effects of meadowsweet that I want you to be aware of not when I say help with fevers I don't mean go ahead and use it once you have a fever and then expect it to work as quickly as other um, you know uh, chemical made uh, pharmaceuticals uh, well, how herbal medicine works it's very gentle and it's very gradual on the body so you wouldn't expect it to work as 